My name is uh, Benny Abbott, and I reside in Jasper, Alabama, which is about an hour northwest of Birmingham. And uh, my company is Abbott Consulting and Coding Inspections. And uh, I've been inside of the coatings industry for a little over 26 years professionally and enjoy my job. Well, I started, you know, it was, I was a, come out of the, a family of uh, painting contractors. My dad put the uh, blast nozzle in my hand when I was 13, let me try it. And that was a very big mistake because I was hooked. Back in probably 1992, maybe 1993, I had a uh, good friend, which was a coatings rep for uh, Sharon Williams. He started talking to me then about I should go go and achieve MACE certification and put it off, put it off from that time till the, about, two, about 2000. But uh, I've always been, in, been interested inside of the work, uh, the quality control procedures as well as the equipment and how, how things work. That's what makes my mind work is learning how the equipment works, the coding system works, what's the basis of corrosion, and how we can uh, make these coatings last longer. Sometime in the year 2000, I took my first NACE CIP-1 course. And then I also took the very first NACE nuclear course. I guess it was 2010, because I went right after that course uh, in August and uh, done five and a half months at Three Mile Island doing service level uh, one coating inspections. With Three Mile Island, uh, you know, it's a misconception that there's two units there. There's unit one and there's unit two. Unit two is the one that had the partial meltdown. So unit one is still running strong. And uh, what, I, what I was in there for was doing the service level one in inspections for the steam generator replacements. The certifications give me more reputation within the industry. Uh, I, when I go in to talk to a new, a new client or a potential client and bring up that I have NACE Level 3 certifications, then that sort of strikes a tone with them better. They know that they're dealing with, with someone that has experience. I guess the biggest thing I really uh, thrive on doing is teaching others. We don't never just learn so much and then stop learning. Uh, I try to learn something new every day that I possibly can because the industry is constantly changing. And if you stop learning, then you've just, you've basically stopped your, stopped your whole career. Thank you.